Hello everyone, I hope you all survived the first week. Hi, I'm Rachel. I'm a first year graduate student at St. Peter's College and I'm reading for an MST in Jewish Studies. I've been in Oxford for about two weeks now, but it feels like I've been here for a month. So much has happened, it's hard to wrap my head around it. Last week was Freshers' Week, which basically means you have induction meetings at your college, at your department. Uh, you get a lot of flyers, as you can see from my notice board over there. And free stuff, lots of free stuff. Um, I got um, free food, free drinks, free champagne, free wine. I even got free laundry liquid, which will last me for a long, long time. We have a really active middle common room, also known as an MCR here at St. Peter's, and they always made sure that there was something fun and sociable happening in Freshers' Week and also in Minus One Week. A lot of graduates actually have to come earlier than undergrads because we have meetings sometimes or just extra induction stuff that happens in Minus One Week, and so it was really nice that the MCR made sure that there was stuff happening so you wouldn't have to wait until Freshers' Week to meet other people and other people in your college and you wouldn't have to feel alone in the first few days. This past week was first week, so term has officially begun. Since terms are only eight weeks long here, you really have to hit the ground running. I've already submitted a 2,000 word long essay, I've read for hours and hours and hours, been to four different libraries, done lots of homework, and pulled my first all-nighter on the second day of term. So yeah, it's been intense, and I know it's only just the beginning. For all graduate and undergraduate freshers, tomorrow's matriculation day, which means you get to parade around Oxford in gowns and more to boards and just generally look like we're supposed to be at Hogwarts. The matriculation ceremony is held at the Sheldonian Theatre, is entirely in Latin, and it's how you become a member of the university. After matriculation comes matriculash, and I'm sure you can figure out what that entails. One thing's for sure, at Oxford you work hard, you play hard, and you never sleep.